Uh, what's going on guys, your boy Kieran O'Reilly. Today's video, I'm going to be filming a QA and a with my girlfriend. Oh, <laughs> this is awkward. <laughs> Hang on a minute. Oh wait, <laughs> we're the wrong way round. <laughs> Hang on a minute. Ah, we're back. Right, <laughs> I've changed my top. <laughs> right, first off, I'm going to start off shouting out grit. That's just the cop box. Right. <laughs> Right, basically, guys, sent me some new tops and that. Oh, your New tops. Yeah. Uh, a flex fender, two new wheels. Sicko. So they can match my blue setup. And basically, a few stickers and bands and stuff. So if you see me about, then this literally isn't all I got. Like, I've got more in the box. But if you see me about on the Isle of Wight, then come and ask me for a band or something. I'll keep them in my bag and hand them out. I'm going to apologise again for this black mark here. It's so annoying, there's literally nothing I can do about it. But you guys said on the video that I'd done the poll like, thing on in the cards that you didn't mind it being there as long as I'm still like producing content and stuff. So yeah, let's jump into the video. Right guys, so I put out a post on Instagram why are you looking at me like that? Why? I put out a post on Instagram. I'll put the picture on the screen like there in between us of what it actually was. <laughs> Whoa, mate. I asked you guys to comment questions on my Instagram on the post that I put up. Questions for me and Lily to do a QA and a video on. So we're going to start. We've got 73 comments. I need to sneeze again. <laughs> Bless you. Whoa. All of these... might not seem many to some, but there's quite a few. I've just hit 7,900 followers as well, so I'm 97 away from 8K. So getting closer to that 10K mark where I'll be doing a giveaway and you'll basically have to get me to 10K to find out what the giveaway is. <laughs> so, well, you'll find out when I hit like 9K or something because I'll announce what it is to, yeah, you get what I mean. Right, so I'm gonna let Lily choose the questions because there's literally like three that she can answer because everyone seemed to just ask me questions because I'm loved. Mm -hmm. Right, yeah, I'll let Lily choose questions. Tom underscore Strath, what is your favourite trick? My favourite trick? Oh, I don't even know. My favourite trick to do is probably like a backflip 360 or a flare flat or something. Yeah, One of those okay. two. Moving on. Underscore Kenny underscore Cork <laughs> One... <laughs> L L underscore. <laughs> <laughs> the L. Worst injury. Worst injury. Tearing a ligament in my knee. I've torn a ligament in the same knee four times and dislocated it over a hundred. It sounds ridiculous, but over a hundred. Like my knee is literally locked out of place now, and I pull it in and it'll click and yeah. But yeah, tearing ligaments probably. T J B three asked dot S M X. What football team do you support? Manchester United, but I don't follow football anymore. Mm. She's a dirty Liverpool man. Liverpool! No, that's dirty. No. Pure dirt. No. I don't follow football anymore though, but yeah, the football team I supported when I followed football was Manchester United. Evan Bailey, 14 underscore, where did you meet? I was gonna say we met at school, basically. We didn't talk or anything, but we knew of each other's existence, and then. Because he was famous <laughs> on telly. <laughs> yeah, and then Lily put up a status, right? <laughs> Say it. Oh Someone pop up. So I popped up. Go. Man slid in those DMs. <laughs> oh, Harry Milford seven seven. If you had the choice between Megan Fox and Taylor Swift, I seen this a comment earlier. <laughs> Cheers, mate. <laughs> Megan Fox. Great. <laughs> Mackie underscore Blackburn. What inspired you to ride? What or who? What. What inspired you to ride? Um, I don't know really. I went. I was. I remember how I started. I was at a skate park in. I think it was Portsmouth, and I was with basically my mum's friend's son, and he was on a skateboard. I was on a bike, and I must have been like eight or nine. Oh, I would have been nine, saying that just time nine, and. We was at the skate park and there was kids there on scooters. So I asked a kid if I can go on his scooter. It was a, I think it was either a micro or a JD bug. And the very first ramp I went down was a five foot quarter pipe. 
and from then it was just like really fun like, I was literally instantly started spinning tail whips and everything like it was just it, was, it seemed really fun so I asked for a scooter for my birthday shout out to Nancy for getting me it for my birthday for my 10th good old Nancy coming in clutch with the scooters Ethan Dot Dalloway how did you two meet? well I pretty much just answered that so through school official underscore jack underscore norman tips for getting noticed well it says gritting noticed but getting noticed <laughs> <laughs> tips for getting noticed right i don't really know what to say <laughs> i was 12 years old right uh no i wasn't saying that i was 11 i think and a fella called chris austin come down from scotland on a holiday and I was riding local like every day as I used to all the time. I remember I'd just torn a ligament in my knee. And uh, no, I would have just been 12 then. I would have just turned 12. And I remember I torn a ligament in my knee because I'd done that the day after my 12th birthday. So I wasn't riding like properly. I was doing some decent tricks and stuff. And if you haven't seen my sponsor edit, he's the producer of that. He's the guy that made it. So big credit to him and that. He basically asked me, He, I remember it as well, he come up to me and asked me if he can film me and make me an edit. So I was like, yeah, whatever, like, it's cool. People are asking to film me and stuff. It was obviously pretty cool. I didn't have a sponsorship or anything and like, I wasn't like known. I was just known on the Isle of Wight for scooters. So he put up that video and then like that's basically how I got noticed. But it was a lot easier to get noticed five and a half years ago when I got sponsored to what it is now because there's so many riders in the industry and so many like insane riders out and about so tips for getting noticed i'd say probably just upload to instagram and youtube because instagram wasn't a thing then either like it was probably out but it wasn't a thing to put clips on and stuff so i'd say instagram and youtube that was quite the explanation wasn't it oh, yeah. <laughs> <Bloody hell. laughs> stretch that out a bit right moving on Danielson for Falmia. yeah do you still remember me? I hope so. I think. <laughs> I don't want to sound really bad, but I'm pretty sure you comment on all of my YouTube videos. Obviously, I'd re I'd remember you if you was to comment that on my YouTube video because like, I can remember like the name looks familiar on YouTube, but Instagram's different. Scott, so yeah. Scoot. Mackie underscore Blackburn. How long have you been riding? Uh, seven and a half years. No, yeah, just over seven and a half years. I started when I was ten, and I'm five months away from being eighteen. November, November this August, September, no, October, year, again. October, November, December, January. A year and a half. Too long. Yeah. Too long. <laughs> I need a medal. Honestly, I actually I need, need a medal. medal. You don't Jesus. understand. I need a medal. A year and a half, eighteen months. Ugh. I think you'd love to scoot her more than me. <laughs> Nah, I'm joking. <laughs> She's not. Nathaniel West. Hey, my boy. Hey. I've heard a lot about you and seen videos of you. <laughs> my G. <laughs> if you could get free access to any skate park, what would it be? In the UK, obviously Corby. And anywhere else other than the UK, I'd say Woodward. <laughs> Woodward. I don't know like what one, because there's quite a few different ones, I believe, but... Woodward, <laughs> all of them. Kieran underscore ball 15, why did you start scootering? Well, I've explained that, like when I was at the skate park, I seen the kid in the scooter, asked if I can have a go. If he had said no, I might not have even started scootering, how mad is that? <laughs> if he had been like a bad mood or anything and said, like you're not having a go. You should tell him, we should find him and tell him that you no, are not. I, I wouldn't even remember it, like, his face. What was your first scooter trick? Who said that? The uh, Kieran underscore ball. First, first scooter trick. Yeah. What was your first? Right, my trick? first scooter trick. Hop. If you're not counting, <laughs> if you're not counting like standard flat tricks like hop, like bunny hops on one hand as one foot oh, and right. stuff, probably. <laughs> I could just about to jump. <laughs> <laughs> probably. A, no, it was a tail whip. I think it was a tail whip, then a three sixty, and then moving on from there. I used to be really bad at bar spins. Like I used to hate them. I used to do throw bars, and um, like before I started doing like bus drivers, I I absolutely used to hate bar spins. But yeah, that's probably <clears> yeah. <laughs> People seem to land bars before whips, but I was the other way around. Will Sneep, how old were you when you landed your first backflip? On a scooter. I don't yeah. know. Uh, wait, show me. 
How old were you when you landed? Yeah, it must be. Uh, what was I? Started at 10, went to court at 11. <laughs> no. Literally that, I learnt a backflip a year into riding and a flare, I think, a year and a half into it. I learnt flares straight to metal. You've probably heard of a BMXer called Mark Webb. I used to go to South Sea every single weekend and he taught me them. I sent them straight to metal. No, like, foam pits or anything. And, yeah, <laughs> I landed a flare sixth attempt with Mark Webb teaching me at South Sea straight to metal in the space of ten minutes. Sonny Buzz underscore... What's your dream scooter? Please include this. <laughs> <laughs> My dream scooter is what I've got now. <laughs> Literally, like, I don't even think about any other parts and stuff. Like, I used to go down my local before I moved off Yard of White and one of my mates down there, I'm not going to name him, but his, I'm not going to name his last name, but his name was Jack and he used to have a grit, I think it was the Grit Elite, like the very first Grit Elite and it was a, uh, like a light blue and light blue bars and a white deck and I never knew that was grit until like shortly after and I used to do flips on it, I used to love riding that scooter, it was so nice and then I ended up on grit, <laughs> like I've literally basically, well I've been on grit and had more grit parts, like literally grit is all I'd ride and all I do ride. Joshua Alexander, one two three. Hey Josh, my boy. Can you do a flip check? I think I've seen this earlier. Can you shout me out? Yeah, yeah. shout me out. <laughs> right, shout out to Joshua Alexander, one two three. I'll put his Instagram here because I'm nice, and oh. he does YouTube as well. So go subscribe to his channel. His channel is blowing up like mad. Like, his channel is blowing up <laughs> mad as well. Sounded American. His channel was like proper blowing up as well. Oh, like he, he messaged me a few, well, probably about two, three months ago and was like, I'm on 700 subscribers and like was talking about it and stuff. And then now he's already on like 1,200, nearly 1,300, like it's mental. So go subscribe to him. He makes sick videos every single day and they're good quality and stuff as well. So go do that. And what was the question? Do a flip check. Oh, that means I've got to go outside. Right. I thought it was asking you, can oh. you? <laughs> right, I've got to do the flip check, so I'm going to cut to an outside scene. You might not see it very well because it's dark outside, but I'll go and quickly do one. Right, I don't know if you're going to, like, see it, but I'll do one now. Quick, it's cold. <laughs> oh, the floor's wet. You'll be fine. Hey guys, it's Comedy Shorts Gamer here. <laughs> <laughs> You're not putting that in the way. I am. No, she practices that like when I'm out and stuff. What the f And she yeah. finds my camera. Yeah. She practices it all the time. It's weird. Right, anyway. Uh, we've got to carry on with the questions. <laughs> Would you send a double flare? Dylan Carr underscore 14. Um. Maybe. <laughs> well, yeah, I would. <laughs> Maybe. Like, I would. I've just said that twice. I would if I found like a quarter to foam pit where I didn't hit the wall behind. Like, I'd, I'd try it. Like, I've tried a double flare before straight into foam, but I've done a flare to front flip at Prevail because there wasn't a quarter for me to turn into. Jet with three T's, three J E H triple T. How long into riding did you land to flare? I think it was about a year and a half, honestly. It wasn't any longer than two years. It was a year and a half, I'm sure. I learnt backflips, I think it was, I've just literally just remembered, I think it was 11 months into riding that I learnt how to backflip. So it was about a year and a half flares. James Huntley, 2003, what was your scariest trick you have ever tried? The scariest trick I've ever tried, oh I don't really know to be honest, probably... Flare flat, on our driveway. Uh, <laughs> nah. uh, probably, I don't really, I really don't know. Like, what's the, the, what's the scary, scary trick? No. What's the scary trick? The wibbly one. The what you're one? You're doing the end, you your feet, like you did in ICSB and said it's funny. Oh, wait, rewind, rewind. <laughs> she laughs at my body because like, I moved it side to side like this, doing a rip, rewind, rewind weird. over a four foot spine. But obviously I was like, getting the whip round and kicking it as fast as I could so I landed it. But There's things you can't bloody say. <laughs> yeah, because they, like, <laughs> A lot oh, no. of my viewers are young, so. Yeah. Can you learn cash rolls? Underscore Kane, underscore, 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 underscore. Well, not anyone can learn anything, so yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Street Rad, can you flare flat? Also, can you cash me outside? How about that? 
I really don't know what that means. I looked on, I was on Neckbeard's Instagram earlier, and uh, I seen him hashtag that, but I don't actually know what it means. So you're probably gonna have to fill me in with the trend or like, whatever's <laughs> cool these days. But yeah, suck and flare flat. You're not hundred. <laughs> <laughs> Taylor with an X dot underscore Wyatt with an X. When will you get the Bry quad whip? The next session that I try it, definitely. Because I got ridiculously close and the only reason I stopped trying it is because I was brakeless and I hate riding brakeless, so yeah, next session. Next session that I'm trying it anyway and I find a good enough quarter. James Power underscore Chris, who inspires you? Dakota. Who? He's always... D James Power underscore Crisp. Oh, you said Chris Poo uh, <laughs> <who> inspired you. <laughs> Listen to that, it right. honestly did. Who inspires you? Dakota Schutz. Like, he's always inspired me. He's insane. And everything that he does, I do the same way. Like, not intentionally, but, like, we do all the tricks the same way. Like, it's just... Who's that? Mental. Dakota. Oh, yeah. Jaden 5 bid. Can you fast plant front flip flat? No. I can spin it to my bottom. But that's about it. He can face plant, front <laughs> flip, flip, whatever it was. Right, what was that now? <laughs> yeah, what was that? Just Riley underscore underscore, have you ever been to Cali? No. I do plan on going to California soon though, I just don't have it planned. <laughs> There are, there are a lot of questions. <laughs> that doesn't make sense at all, but I would very much like to go to California. Is Chris underscore Snittilly, can you front flare? No, never tried. I've never even tried a front flip 180 into a foam pit, like, just, no. Sounds dangerous. Underscore Harley, 03 underscore, have you ever been behind bars? No. <laughs> no, I haven't, no. What do you think of him? <laughs> Jamie Jaggard, my boy, he used to ride with me all the time. He used to be such a sick rider, then he gave up, but... He used to be so sick. Uh, what made you start vlogging? Keep it up, buddy. Basically, I was watching, like, the likes of Tanner Fox and, like, K uh, Corey and Cape from Funk and, like, obviously, like, them lot, the Bow Bros and stuff, and, I don't know, it just made me want to do it. I, I watched loads of their videos, and I decided to just pick up a camera one day and start doing it and get over my fear of, like, what everyone else thought. Like, I genuinely just stopped caring what everyone else's opinions were of me and just started doing what I enjoyed doing and it's working out so far so yeah very proud that. of him for that <laughs> r-h-e-i-s-s -S -S dot cashin what and who inspired you to make a youtube channel I literally just answered that <laughs> look at that uh, <laughs> bloody hell n3il like nil with a three underscore dot one three two zero zero three <laughs> What's your favourite trick and dream trick? My favourite trick, I um, think I answered it earlier, didn't I? Yeah. I can't remember what I said though. My favourite yeah. trick to land is going to be a Bri Buttercup. Like, it's the nicest feeling trick to land, but my nicest trick to do is like a flare flat or something. Or even like something simple like a 360 downhill or Bri Triple Repair or just something like that. Means and, nothing to me. <laughs> <laughs> and my dream trick is probably like, like my proper dream trick would be like backflip quint whip or something like, I could probably learn that, I've spun it before but uh, I can do backflip quads but yeah probably back quint I'm gonna learn that this year saying that, I'm gonna learn that this year backflip quint whip, you'll see that on my Instagram or in my next edit connor.hobbs12, what tips would you give to someone trying to learn flip tricks and combos don't give up <laughs> literally all I can say is don't give up Like. If you have a bad fall whilst you're trying it, don't let it put you off because that's how you like fail to learn. So the only way you can learn new things is if you try and that's basically how I've learned all my tricks is just not giving up. Uh, even if like, I've tore a ligament in my knee four times, I've had really bad injuries and face planted a lot of times, <laughs> you could probably tell. But you literally just get up and do them again. She's looking at this for the me daughter. I'm a daughter. <laughs> My daughter. <laughs> I'm a daughter. Oh, right, I'm going to answer one more question, guys, and then Lily's going to ask, like, one more. I'm going to choose a random one. I'm going to choose a random one. We'll get them all up. I'll do it random. Right, I'll do it on there. Stop. What's been the most annoying trick to learn for In you? Person. Kieran underscore young underscore 2k16 the most annoying trick and the trick I've landed the least amount of times ever is a full whip I've only ever landed them flat I've landed one rotor whip up a fly out like once ever and 
that was a, a place called Hatfield Bowl, like Hatfield Little Bowl Skate Park. If you follow my Instagram, you know what bowl I'm on about, the little concrete one. And uh, the most annoying trick to learn, other than that, that I've done loads of times now, is probably a flare flat. Because it took me over a year to learn. <laughs> it took me over a year, a, a year of flare flat attempts. And Lily's just given up with a video. But a year of flare flat attempts to learn. And that was a long time. Right, Lily's gonna answer one, and then we shall end the video. I'm gonna pick random. Now, every time you see me pull my knee up, it's clicking it back into place. <laughs> That's how bad my knee is. Like, listen to this, right? I'm gonna grab the camera, listen. I don't know if you hear it, but look. Stop! Stop, stop. That's literally my knee. Look, no sound effects, <laughs> no like mouth movements or sound effects, look. Mental, isn't it? <laughs> right, yeah. So, you can't see on there, but. So. No. Oh, we've done that. Connor K, X double L Y Hall underscore. What's your favourite skate park? Favourite skate park that I've been to. Bearing in mind this was about four or five, well, about five years ago, was Corby. Now it's had all of the like refurbishments done and everything, and all the new bits put in the park and everything. I literally haven't run a Corby for about five years. But that's my favourite skate park that I've ever been to. And other than that, my favourite skate park is probably a... Like, I've got a choice between two, which is either Sea Close Skate Park on the Isle of Wight and Cow's Skate Park on the Isle of Wight. That's just what probably else? them two. Two more. We're doing two more. <laughs> Blake Edwards, 6742. Will you ever come to Australia? If I have the money, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's basically as simple as that. If I ever have the time and enough money to do so, then I'll travel to anywhere. Australia especially, because the weather looks insane. So do the skate parks. Sunny underscore photography, 2017. Shout out to him. I gave him a shout out in my last Instagram shout out videos. My biggest fear is drowning. What's yours? Clowns and spiders. <laughs> Yeah. Saying that actually, my biggest fear is like drowning, but so's like my other fear is being framed. They're like my only two fears is like drowning and someone framing me for something that they done and actually getting away with it. So I get in trouble for it, like if That's that makes really any random. sense. It's not, I've always thought of it like if someone kills someone and I get framed for murder, then I get sent down for life and I'm actually innocent but can't prove it. Uh, that's like, it's a weird fear, but it's something I always think about. But anyway, <laughs> hopefully this video was entertaining enough for you guys. It's We filmed for about 45 minutes, so hopefully it's like a fairly long video. And hopefully I answered, well, we did answer most of your guys' questions. So leave the video a thumbs up. This is my girlfriend, Lily. Say hello, say goodbye. Bye bye. And <laughs> we will see you in the next video we do together, and I'll see you in my next video that I film. Yeah, <laughs> any last words? Bye. Oh, shout out. Shout Me. out to who? Right, her Instagram's on the screen, at lilylolly156. Right, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.